everybody Ann here and it's a rainy day today so what am I gonna do I don't know I think I should make something cool first of all look at I woke up to this guy was right by my van window doing his cock doo and woke me up and I thought you know what I'm gonna go out and feed him some oats so I threw a couple handfuls of oats out there and my chicken is nowhere to be seen this morning so I hope nothing's happened to her um, the baby chick something has definitely happened to the baby chick there's been some hawks flying around in our area and so we have not seen baby chick for several days anyway yeah so this is what I wake up to in the morning Rudy the rooster cockadoodle doing right by my window you know what that is just fine because I was ready to get up anyhow neighbor Ann gave me this little Christmas tree and I have put it up on a couple center blocks and I have bungeed it to the pole top and bottom so it would not blow away and in a little bit here I'm gonna try and decorate it hopefully I can beat the rain so I don't know it's supposed to rain all day okay and just in case any of you were wondering what it gets like out here when it rains oh there's a Christmas tree I had to stop decorating it I don't know if you can see that but there's like little rivers running all around my property and it's just complete mud and there's no way I can get out until it has dried for a couple of days so this is the bad part of living out here is all of this rain and an inopportune time so I gotta get some gravel out here I gotta make a lot of parking area if I get a trailer, I'm going to put it right over there between those two trees. If you can see them, just look how hard it's raining. And um, make the rest of this main area just lots of gravel. Um, hopefully have my garden over there by the fence. But yeah, so this is what it's like. And look at my little Christmas tree out there getting rained on. But the good thing is, is the ornaments that I did get put up, I actually tied them to the tree. So hopefully they won't fall down and get covered in mud but yeah I got a mud river Tennessee clay mud river lovely but at least the van's getting a washing so yeah little blessings silver linings you got to take them where you can so what to do on a rainy day I'm gonna make me some special coffee this is just can't do it with one hand this is just a paper towel I'm putting down in there for the coffee because I don't have any coffee filters so let me get the rest of the stuff and I'll show you this delicious thing I'm gonna make one scoop of French vanilla coffee, one scoop of unsweetened cocoa, and just a coffee scoop. I think it's probably about a tablespoon. Close this down over the top of it. Close this, and my filming is terrible. Turn it on. Oh, I gotta plug it in. Yep, so I'm gonna turn it on, and then we gotta wait for a little bit. Okay, now that we've got a little bit of coffee that's been brewed, I'm gonna pour it into my big old mug. There we go. And put this back. And then I'm gonna add a couple more things to this. I'm gonna add one heaping tablespoon of sugar, two heaping tablespoons of powdered milk. There's the other one. I'm gonna put the lid on. I made a mess on my sleepy pants even though it's after 12 in the afternoon and then I'm just gonna shake that up really well that way the sugar and the milk is all gonna be nice and mixed up yum and then we just have to wait till the coffee gets done brewing and there's one more special ingredient mmm look at how nice and frothy that looks and now I'm just gonna pour in the rest of the coffee Gotta leave a little room for the last ingredient. Here it comes. I have the best neighbors. Yep, we're gonna put a little shot of this into the coffee. Mmm, that smells so good. Alrighty, we're gonna put that lid back on and I'm gonna do it with two hands so I don't spill it. Shake it up and see how it tastes. Shake a shake a shake a. Shaking it up. I don't know what I should call this. What do you think? Um. Chocolate peppermint schnapps coffee. <laughs> All right, let's see what it tastes like. Here we go, folks. Mmm. Now this is a delicious cup of coffee. 
All right, so this is really, really good. It is delicious. Mmm. It's got like that milky flavor. It's got the peppermint flavor from the schnapps. Yeah. And it's got the chocolate. I think I'm going to call this Christmas coffee. Yes, Christmas coffee. It is so good, you guys. You've got to try it. Mm-mm-mm. Hmm. -mm. Anyway, it stopped raining for a few minutes. I may go out and try and finish my, finish decorating my little Christmas tree. Um, I didn't get to finish it all, just started pouring down rain. And it's too muddy, really, to do anything. I can't get this van out right now unless I would be pulled. There's no way I could get, get it off my lot. I got to get some gravel out here eventually and spread it around. Um, and that's the only downside, but... Um, yeah, this coffee is really good. You should try and make it. And, well, I'll end this video by showing you my cute little Christmas tree, what I've accomplished with it thus far. There she is. Isn't it beautiful? My neighbor gave me the Christmas tree and the decorations, and I'm going to put some more stuff on it and put some lights on it. And it looks kind of crappy right now because I'm shooting through my window. My window's kind of foggy a little bit. But I got a bungee to that tree, and I am definitely getting in the Christmas spirit, so I hope you guys are too. And, uh, well, that's all I got for you guys today. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.